Good morning to my Birch family. Let me just go ahead and say this is about to be so random. I feel like I just haven't sat down and talked to you guys or updated you on my life or told you what's going on in the longest time, right? It feels that way. So many things have happened. Like, what do I start? Oh my gosh. I mean, but look at that dog though. Can we just take a second? Rustin. Why are you so precious? I just love him so much. <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and start out like super random while we're talking about my dog. I was really particular about the breeder that I chose. I wanted to like see the house, see the environment the dogs were in, see the parents, meet the people, like see the vet records. Y'all, I'm, I'm crazy. So I wanted to see all those things. I've never purchased a dog before in my life. I just saw an ad for him in the classifieds and I'm just like, I'm gonna go look. I'm not really gonna purchase this dog like so the whole reason i just went into that spiel is because she has a litter of puppies right now and they're so freaking cute the majority of them look like little baby rustins i can't another reason why i want to talk about this is because i get a lot of messages about where i got him what's her information all that kind of stuff so i am gonna have her facebook page linked in the description box if you want to go check it out i love my dog like love i love my dog so much <laughs> that I made a Rustin sticker, so you should check that out on our website. Hi, huh, Rustin. Do you have your own sticker? Yeah, you do, huh? Speaking of stickers, we got more new stickers. We have a Stay Weird sticker and also a Create Your Own Journey sticker. I actually did both of them myself and Rustin, y'all. I sold my car because Oh my gosh, I'm like so all over the place. Let me back up. So for those of you that are new to our Birch family, I am living in Norfolk, Virginia because my husband is in the military. So I moved here from Ruston, Louisiana, hence where my dog got his name. We've been here for about a year now and he's about to go on his first deployment and I am gonna move back home to Louisiana. And so that's basically what this entire vlog is about. Uh, even though there was a bunch of rambling and things in the beginning of this, I just felt like there were so many things I had to tell you guys. So because he is deploying, uh, I sold my car, but I didn't realize how attached to my car I was. I've had it for almost 10 years but I mean when I was cleaning it out to sell it I still had like Katie hair in there that was like stuck and wouldn't come out which definitely opened up like wounds that haven't completely healed yet if some of y'all don't know who Katie is um y'all must be new my first ever dog on my own as an actual adult I had her for eight years and oh anybody that knows me knows how much I loved that freaking dog. And earlier in this year, I ended up having to put her to sleep because she got cancer like out of the blue, out of nowhere, and there's nothing I could do about it. And that whole situation sucked. Looking back, I know I did the right thing by euthanizing her because she was suffering, wasn't eating, vomiting, having diarrhea, and I just didn't want to see her like that. And I knew she was miserable, and so I knew it was the right thing to do. The vet came to the house and euthanized her, and honestly, that was the best experience. If you're in the situation where you think it's time to euthanize your pet, call your vet and see if they do a house call, because that was the best experience. And I don't think I'll ever do it any other way ever again. I can honestly say that for me, having a puppy in the house was the best thing that I could have done. And he has been such a joy and I am obsessed. He's even cute when he licks his butthole. So yeah, that brings me to now, which I'm supposed to be packing right now, but I'm obviously procrastinating talking to you guys, which is totally cool. I'm able to get access to our storage unit tomorrow, and I have the whole month of November to pack before we have to be out of here. We have to be out of here at the end of December. You know, I need to point out like how good my skin is looking recently. I got a new foundation, which I think that's what it is, but like, like what the heck? I don't know what's going on. What? Look, guys, like what on earth is happening to my skin? I swear to goodness if any of you guys comment and say you're pregnant i'm coming for you because i am not pregnant i solemnly swear to my birch family that when i am pregnant first i will film it because i want to be able to remember that moment forever and this is like my little online very public diary and i will title the video oh my god i'm pregnant you always come in so hot with the pregnancy assumptions. I'll be like, hey guys, just ate a giant piece of cake because I need that she is pregnant 
I know she's pregnant. Laying in bed because I don't feel good. Pregnant. 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 Another question I want to address is why there is not any more veterinary content on my channel. I'm not working at a veterinary clinic because, well, my husband's about to deploy. I'm about to move home. Um, some other things happened as well, which I talked about in a live video that some of y'all watched. <laughs> After posting it, I deleted it. And for those of you that watched that video, y'all are more than welcome to inform everybody else why I'm not working at a veterinary clinic anymore. I'm sorry to disappoint you guys that love to come here for those videos. However, I did start a whole new channel called Victoria's Veterinary Vlogs that I'll have linked down below, which when I do start posting veterinary content, again, it will be on that channel. It'll be a completely separate thing from this channel. The people that I love to watch that post veterinary content, I will have their channels linked down below if you need your vet fix. I hope I answered a lot of y'all's questions that I've been getting recently. Like I said, I am gonna be filming me moving and uh, yeah doing that whole process so I'll have that video up probably in a week or so anyway I love you guys so much thank you so much for watching remember to stay weird and I'll see you in our next video bye